Hey, YouTube, this is, um, Obonax1 here, doing part two of my comic books for this month. Um, today I have for you three comics, um, one from Arrow, from the hit TV serial, zero, <laughs> and series from the same name. Um, I have Batman Incorporated, and then I have um, a Batman Detective Comics um, issue nine, part of the Night of Owls comic. So let's get things started with um, my favorite of, well, my second favorite, I think, for this um, for this month. Um, Arrow, um, as mentioned, based on the same TV series, um, show, um, I am very much enjoying watching the show, um, I can't decide whether I'm gonna have a, um, episode by episode, because I'm thinking about re-watching everything again when, um, before the series comes back in January. So, if you would like to see that, please comment below and I'll, um, do that. Um, but anyway, um, this comic has three chapters from the digital comics. Um, if you are joined on the DC um, comic application, um, you can get your comics from DC and get them on to your iPad, um, which you obviously all know, but I was just saying. Um, the first is about Oliver Queen, um, who comes back Star City, to Star City, or Starling City as it's called in the show, um, and it's about Oliver struggling being back home after his five e years of being absent for so long, um, and it's about the struggles of his relationships of what he's doing as Arrow, or Green Arrow. Um, so yeah, and then um, the second chapter is about um, Oliver targeting a man who owns a plant. Um, and this man is part of the list that is that he's hunting through the names of. Um, the man is then killed by Tommy Merlin's father mysteriously. Um, and we see a wonderful scene of um, Tommy Merlin's father and, um, whose name escapes me, and Oliver's mother. And we really get to see the anguish of, um, what she's doing. Um, which is continuing on from, from, from the series where, um, you know, I think, I think Oliver's mother, both in the series and in the comic, is now in too deep that she can't escape from it. And she knows it too. Um, and then the final chapter is um, China White's origin story. And it's kind of brutal. Like, um, yeah, childhood was a bit m messed up. Um, 
I liked the different perspectives in this comic, but um, it's definitely not as good as Smallville was. Um, okay, so the next one is Batman Incorporated. Um, this is about Damian Wayne um, as future Batman. Um, who takes on this sort of, like, zombie-esque Joker plague. Um, excuse me. Um, which is a plan left over by Joker after he... Uh, after he died. Um, and the story does include Barbara Gordon as, um, Commissioner Gordon... And that she's in a wheelchair, which which sort of doesn't make sense as she's now up and walking. So I'm assuming that it's either Barbara Gordon as Oracle in the pre fifty two, or um Barbara Gordon, or Barbara Gordon eventually gets put put back into the wheelchair in the future. And this story is just twisty. I mean, um, you really see that, you know, these babies are insane and basically want to eat your, um, brains. <laughs> brains. Um, I found it interesting that also Arkham City wants, um, a haven for the criminally insane, and um, now becomes a haven for the people of Gotham, while Gotham City is overrun by itself. Um, I thought it was interesting to see the reverse, like... Because, obviously, Asylum... Think Asylum Seekers, and you sort of you get that what that means. So, I mean, it's Gotham City seeking asylum from their own city, and we um, see that um, the government just want to bomb the place and just, you know, try and get rid of the city. And it's very twisty. Um... And also, Damien is a lot more mature, and also feels the weight of his father's mantle weighing down on him. And that was a very, very interesting um, story to read. So, and this was my favourite this month. Well, for these three, certainly. This was my favourite. Um, and finally, Detective Comics Night of the Owls. Um, this is also in Arkham City, just based on um, the more present day stuff. And obviously this story is about um, the night where the Court of Owls try to take back Gotham. Or try to take Gotham. Um, and the story has um, Dr. Arkham, I want to say his name is, um, who's going to be assassinated. And basically, um, the Night of Owls sentence, have sentenced him to death. Um, also, Black Mask appears in this comic, along with many other cameos, but the Black Mask was, like, the big one, because, um, we all thought the Black Mask was dead. I didn't, because I'm new at comics, and I don't know what happened to the Black Mask, but still, he died, I think. He died, and was brought back to life, because of the reboot. <laughs> Um, yeah, this comic was good, um, it's always fun to see, um, 
Arkham again. Um, and it's always good fun seeing, like, the different takes. So, yeah. Um, thank you for watching. Um, I think this is going to be the last, um, comic monthly reviews for this, um, month. But, I, but, um, next month, and uh, next year, in fact, I'm going to have loads and loads of comics for you guys, for me to review for you guys, and I hope you guys are enjoying comic book reviews, and if you have, um, any suggestions, um, um, I want to get better at reviewing stuff, and I want to get better at this, so please, um, help me out if you can, and just, um, comment below if you have any suggestions. And even if you want to talk about comics, you know, I'm definitely game for that. So thank you, and have a Merry Christmas. Bye.